Hi, good morning. morning. Can you just take your last name, please? My name's Phil Hill. Um, I come to this Fear Without Flying because um, I'm planning to go to New York in February and I was very, and every time I go on a plane, I'm very, very anxious. I hate going on a plane. I actually ended up hiding my passport because it got us that bad. Um, so we had to reschedule and reschedule other flights and uh, holidays. Um, and I had a bad experience um, with, a, with the, um, an emergency landing um, in fact, five years ago. Um, so that's what's made me come here today. Hello, I'm Adele Roberts. I'm a pilot at Virgin Atlantic. I've been flying for Virgin Atlantic for about nine years and before that I flew for a company called British Midland. I've been flying since 1998 but I actually learnt to fly when I was only 14 years old. Um, so today's course when we were all ready and we'd finished the technical section, the psychology section and the section from our cabin crew, we uh, departed from the Holiday Inn. We took buses to get up to the uh, Gatwick terminal. We talked a little bit about turbulence in the classroom and actually we were doing a bit of a demonstration on the buses of actually how turbulence can feel when you're on a bus and comparing that to how turbulence can feel on an aeroplane and we actually found that turbulence on a bus feels worse and that if we were to take our hands off the things that we were holding on to on the bus we'd in fact fall over, it was that turbulence. So that was a very useful thing to have done. Um, so once we arrived at Gatwick today, uh, we walked through the terminal together in a big team, about a hundred of us, and we arrived at the Monarch check-in desks and uh, Monarch check-in desks they were really good for us today they had four desks open so check-in didn't take very long took about 20 minutes to get a hundred of us through and they gave us our boarding cards and uh, today it was free seating so passengers could choose where they wanted to sit on the flight today so that was brilliant and then uh, upstairs into the departure area of uh, Gatwick terminal and through security um, a few of us went through the normal security channel some of us went through the uh, premier security channel just just to get it going through and again that was really speedy today so that took us just about 10 minutes to get through that process and then once out into uh, the Gatwick um, main departures area we then had to find our own way to the aeroplane as you generally do so we had to check on the departure boards and look for our little flight today which was Gatwick to Gatwick obviously confusing a lot of passengers in the departure terminal today looking up at the departure board going Gatwick to Gatwick I've not seen that before uh, so yeah we arrive at gate gate 11 today and uh, the airplane was all ready for us so we uh, got on board very very quickly and uh, we sat down got ourselves settled in for the flight and after not very long time at all the uh, the doors closed and uh, we were ready to make our departure. Now we had um, three pilots in the flight deck today um, in addition to myself sitting in the cabin and one of our pilots in the flight deck today did an entire commentary from engine start, push back, taxi out, take off, um, cruise and then through to landing so the passengers enjoyed that for the entire flight. So today we taxied out for a departure on runway 08 at Gatwick. Uh, we trundled off down the runway, got to about 170 miles an hour, and then we got airborne to a, a peal of great applause as everyone congratulated themselves um, for actually getting into the air, which was brilliant. Um, and then we climbed to about 21,000 feet today, and we did a little circuit of the south coast, round over the Isle of Wight, and back in. Now today we were quite fortunate that we actually did experience some turbulence. Sometimes we ask people in the classroom, would you like to experience turbulence today or would you not? And it's always some people want to and some people people don't and it's actually better today because the professionals were on board with them that actually they did experience turbulence today and we were there to talk them through it so that was really good and everyone actually came through the other side of the turbulence actually having understood that it was safe and actually with smiles on their faces which was really nice to see um, the approach into land was very, very smooth and the landing was very, very beautiful from the Monarch captain. Um, and then we taxied off the runway and we came back in onto uh, the stand and we came into an international stand this time instead of a domestic stand. So we then had to get on buses to transfer over to the domestic part of the terminal area. So a hundred of us got back on buses and went uh, back through the terminal area, back through to the passenger side, so through security again. 
and then exited the terminal again back onto buses and then we all came back to the Holiday Inn where I'm standing right now. Virgin Atlantic flying without fear course we uh, were very proud to say that we have a 98% success rate um, and we gauge that on pretty much every course that we that we do. We ask people when they arrive in the day how they feel about flying at the beginning of the day and then we compare that to how they feel about flying at the end of the day. So if you have a fear of flying please log on to our website flyingwithoutfear.co.uk if you come along to one of our courses you can expect to meet someone like me which will take you through the technical side of flying. Um, my job today has really really been to dispel some of the myths around flying and to give back the knowledge to people because we find a lot of fear comes from actually the lack of knowledge about something. So I give people as much knowledge as I can so they can take control of their fear. Um, and then we'll go on to a, a psychology session and we'll have a session from our cabin crew as well from a cabin safety point of view and then we end up the day by going on a flight and today we were very happy that 98% of the people on the course today actually flew today. I found it absolutely brilliant and um, very helpful all the staff are very knowledgeable all the, um, all the staff have got actions for everything how am I feeling right now? Top of the world. I feel like I could just jump in a plane right now and go anywhere I like. Uh, because I'm that confident, I can be by myself. And what my biggest achievement was, sitting by that window, getting up on that plane, walking around on the plane, while it's in midair, um, and just not feeling like I'm locking up, you know? I just felt so relaxed, and I feel that planes are all the safest way of traveling. I, I would never have said that at the beginning of, the, the beginning of this session. And I'm proud that I've um, succeeded on this, and I'm proud that I've come.